Siemens busway systems are a safe and efficient way to power industrial, commercial, and institutional environments. This video covers the measurement of a field fit piece utilizing Siemens Power to Fit program. Before you begin an installation, make sure you have and are using the Centron installation and maintenance instructions. Suggested tools for the measurement of busway are tape measure, level, and laser measurement tool. Siemens Power to Fit program compensates for dimensional deviations that may result in Centron busway layouts. With the Power to Fit program, specific busway pieces and straight sections and elbows may be excluded from factory released diagrams. These final fit sections are measured in the field and quick shipped from the Siemens busway factory. Generally, factory lead time increases as quantity or complexity of fit pieces increases. Before beginning measurement, it is recommended you download the Siemens Power to Fit program brochure which has blank fields to record your measurements. Straight sections are the easiest to field measure. Straight sections have a minimum length of 14.38 inches and a maximum length of 120 inches. Straight section measurements must be measured from joint support to joint support. The arrow on the joint support points to the A phase or ground side of the busway. The busway nameplate, frequently designated NP on the factory diagrams, is on the neutral side of the bus. The nameplate or neutral side must be denoted when measuring straight sections to indicate phasing. Measurement of a flat 90 degree elbow is slightly more difficult. The same reference point, the joint support, is used to measure this fitting. In this case, you'll need to make two measurements both to the outer surface of adjacent bus, determining an X and Y dimension. These will drive the elbow leg lengths. Elbow minimum and maximum lengths are defined by orientation, amperage, and conductor material. Measurement of an edge 90 degree elbow is similar to that of a flat 90 degree elbow. Measurements to the outer surfaces must still be taken, the only difference being these outer surfaces are now the top or bottom of the bus instead of the sides. The final type of field fit measurement is the straight section between an elbow stack and the neighboring section. The elbow stack can be either an edge or a flat stack. For all practical purposes, you will replicate what was done for the flat elbow, measuring from the joint support of the neighboring section to the far side of the piece connecting to the elbow stack. Once you have completed all field measurements, you will need to send these measurements to your local Siemens sales contact. Lead time, as defined in the Siemens Power to Fit brochure, will commence upon confirmation of receipt from the Siemens Busway plant. If you have any questions or need further assistance at any time while using Siemens Busway systems, please refer to the storage, installation, and maintenance instructions or visit usa.siemens.com busway. Siemens, ingenuity for life.